Hello everybody, my name is Kanker Poseidon, also known as KP Games. Welcome back to Vampire. So in this episode we're gonna um finish following the tracks, we're gonna finish following the tracks. Opportunity. Oh, we're gonna do a sneak attack as well. We're gonna do It's done! Mmm. Nice, nice. Nice. All right, what we're going to do is a sneak attack. All right, enemy card. Some enemies are more resistant to certain types of damage. There are four types of damage resistances. Melee, ranged, blood, and shadow. Orange indicates medium resistance. Red indicates high resistance. So I assume the blue stuff, the blue, is probably um no resistance, if any. So this guy would be weak to shadow and blood. This guy's weak to vampire powers, ironically. That's what he's weak to. Ooh, range weapons. Go ahead and press triangle to use range weapons. Inflict both standard damage and stun damage. Be aware that your ammo is limited. Good. I may need a lot of bullets. I feel like I'm back on the front line. Except they're more stronger. Alright. Don't want to fight them. Alright. Let's kill him. Let's kill him. Let's kill him. Eyes down. Nice, nice, nice. Disable them. Shotgun shells, ooh. Got some shillings here. Alright, cool. The question is, do we want to kill that big boy there? Alright, come on. Drain them, drain them. Alright, kill them. Finish them off. Dodge. Alright, let's kill this dude. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. Give me that. Lead rod and shillings. Nice. Alright, cool. So we killed them for more ammo. Probably get the jump on one of them. Over there. There's one of them I dodge. Ooh. Alright. Heal. Heal. Dodge and heal. Ah, uh, oh well. I got enough. I got enough health. Right. I assume that the health upgrades probably don't branch out. I feel like it'd be kind of weird to branch out those kind of upgrades. I could be wrong, though. I could be wrong. Alright. We got anything? Got any resources that I could take? Help me out for later? No, not really. Alright, then. The blood trails to lead all the way over here. There's also this. Just found a new hideout. You can spend your XP while resting your craft items at the workbench. 
These are basically the equivalents of the Grados from Man Eater. Alright, what do we want? Increase your blood capacity, increase blood absorption. Yeah, I kind of figured. It just is one start line. Oh, these though. Yeah, these passive skills seem just over time. I think that's what I honestly want to do, I think. I know the abilities are pretty cool, but I kind of just want to focus on healing for now. What level are we? We're not level 6 yet, so not quite yet. Let's go ahead and increase our health. Get ourselves some health and stamina. Because why not? That sounds good. Yeah, those are looking pretty good. And we're all out. Defensive blood barrier. You create a visible barrier absorbing direct damage until it fades or is destroyed. Coagulation, you will block your target's blood in their veins, making them defenseless. So it stuns. Basically stuns. We haven't locked these yet. That look cool though. Those look cool. Those look very, very cool. Hmm. Those are very cool. They're so cool in fact I'm not going to spend any money on them. Oh, nope. That's right, you have to confirm it. Alright. Let's go to the new stats. Following night, right? Yeah, look at that. More stats. Refill. Nice. Nope, nope. More shillings. What else we got in here? I might as well before I move on, right? I might as well. I'm not going to. I'm going to guess I can show it off. Yeah, so here you go. Um, Weapons, you can upgrade them too, I believe. Level 2, and then you get increased damage dollar. Increased stamina. Pretty interesting, pretty interesting. Hmm. Alright. We're not going to use any money on that for now, though. We're just going to leave. Nope. Nope, that's not what I want to do. Leave. There we go. Alright. Anything else? Yeah, let's go ahead and drain him real quick. Nice. That free experience. Experience lets us get some more upgrades, so <laughs> I'm all for that. You know, I'm all for that. Alright. Let's go and head back on the trail. Northern Docks District Stable. Fresh blood. The whole building reeks of it. The scent is so strong it makes me dizzy. Oh, it's locked. It's boss battle time. This place reeks of bloodshed. It's boss battle time. This creature is bedeviled. I must put it down. Yeah, boss battle. All right, come on, take him down, take him down. Nice, nice. Go ahead and do that. Let's use that claw, shall we? Yeah, we're just kind of fucking him up right about now. Come on. He isn't that tough. He is kind of a beginner boss, but still.
Alright. Nice. A full blood. A full blood. Yeah, the guy was not that tough. <laughs> like at all. Give me that lead rod and aluminum shards. Nice. I mean, he's just a beginner boss, right? You can't expect a world from him, but... You know. Would have been nice to have some of a challenge. William was an honorable man. I could have saved him. No, you couldn't Mr. have. Hampton. You couldn't have. Are you in there? We knew him well. Another lost soul. A kindred spirit. Sir. Listen to the sound of my voice. I am... I'm a doctor. You're suffering from shock. I must return oh. my flock. they stray without me. Hi. Goodbye, then. Remember, certain scowls are every bit as resistant as we are. Who are you? What do you mean by... It? He was a scowl. You truly are a newborn. I should have realized... Wait. You are the woman from the bar. Are you... like me? Can you help me? I believe, sir, I already have. Oh, okay. Goodbye, then. <laughs> I see your planet needs you. She didn't even teleport up there. That's how good she has at teleporting. She just teleported outside the building. I can't even do that. Alright, let me carry the good doctor. By George and the Saints, you've solved the mystery of these terrible murders. Patience, good fellows. I've come to offer help. Nice. Just give me a moment to secure my boat. We can leave this awful place. That boat looks crazy. William was not the evil man they claimed. He was just taken by the thirst. He needed his drink. This man requires medical attention. We'll see. He gets to the nearest hospital. No, please. I almost tend to my fault. My flock needs me. Yes. Go with a good Dr. Swansea. He's resourceful, and I'm sure he'll take good care of it. Do boats like that actually it exist? Well. With the wheels on the sides? And it's just giant way. steam engine jutting out I the middle? a moment. If I can learn something about what has happened to William, I'll be a step closer to understanding what happened to me. That is true. That is very true. It also gives me an opportunity to search for more resources. This poor creature can't be my maker. Blood sample, William Bishop. Could it be some subspecies of vampire? It is. It is a subspecies I must of vampire. Find a place to analyze the blood. Yeah. Okay. That's it. I'm pretty sure. Now we just get on the boat. At dawn we row. Yeah. Yeah. Pretty much. Ah. Uh, let's do this. My dude's just sitting there. That crawl has really affected me. Why didn't it affect him that much? Curious. Very, very curious. Where are we headed? We're on our way to the Pembroke Hospital. It's just across the canal. They'll have a bed for poor Mr. Hampton. William was... What manner of creature was he? Predator, Skull. Prey, villain, and victim. Who can say? The important thing is that he's been stopped. Duly yeah. noted. And the woman? What? Who is she? What woman? Oh, don't play me for a fool. You used me to locate that skull. You must know right. who she is. And I thought you were gentlemen. You shouldn't talk about a lady behind her back. But I will tell you, she values her privacy. The way he says that. Privacy. Well, as peaceful as she appears from the middle of the canal. It is pretty. The reality of the situation. To be honest, I've always tried to avoid this part of town. Pembroke Hospital is the last bastion between the rest of London and the epidemic. The flu has decimated the East End and the war still rages. Right. Welcome to the front lines of a plague. This is where you work, Dr. Swansea. I am the administrator of Pembroke Hospital. I thought you were yeah, so they got a vampire the infestation the and a flu and pandemic. Soul. Yes. But first and foremost, I'm a man of science. Right. A physician, like yourself, Dr. How, Reed. How do you know who I am? No need for modesty. You are Dr. Jonathan Reed, a surgeon of some caliber. Very of ironic. Life, I'm not mistaken. You are correct, sir. I knew it. I had my suspicions. Just when you took the blood samples. But when you took the blood sample from the corpse of poor William, 
I was certain. Dr. Reed. Marvelous. Ah, Thanks. I really like this guy. Have we met? three of your seminars before the war. I have the utmost admiration for your research. And what a turn of fate. England's most <laughs> the steam blood, blood specialist returns to hunt in the vampire. That word again from a so-called man of science. I mean, how can you explain this? The role of science is to refute myth, but when yeah. myth walks among us, the Brotherhood of St. Paul has dedicated its purpose to their study. There's so much for you to learn. Oh, I'm ready here. I believe. Well, then let me be blunt. Join my staff at Pembroke Hospital. As a physician. I suspect you'll not find a better post of employment to contemplate your uh, predicament. This is sudden. I was returning home, home to see my sickly mother. Sickly mother. But alas, that was before contracting this affliction. Oh, he's a superhuman. Take a moment to consider. The post would be for the night shift, providing a good explanation for your absence during daylight hours. You'll be adequately reimbursed and have a place to hide. I right. even had the forethought to bring some clean clothes. Thanks. So, what do you say? I mean, why not? I got no choice, choice anyways. Since I have no choice. Offer, so yeah. I thank you. Brilliant. Oh, Jonathan. This is one for the book, and the beginning of a beautiful friendship. Aww. I really like that guy. I really do. Off we go. With their tiny rowboat steamboat hybrid. I seriously have never seen that it before. It's kind of weird. It's interesting, but it's weird. Am I dumb? I'm gonna look that up after this episode. Do those exist? Hi, how's it going? Doctor Swansea, thank goodness. I was beginning to be concerned. All right. No more, Nurse Crane. For I bring good news. We have a vampire <laughs> surgeon. Two more patients. Nurse Scow said she couldn't take it anymore and resigned. Yes, well, I'll make a new rotor in the morning. In the meantime, find a good bed for Mr. Hampton. Mr. Hampton. Be sure to pay attention to his needs. Of course, Doctor. I'll have to take care of the regions. So that's something I'll have to do. Yes, Doctor. Doctor Reed here has just returned from the front. He served King Country and will be joining us here at Pembroke. We're very lucky to have gained a surgeon of his talent. And one so experienced in blood transfusions. That is good news indeed, Doctor. <laughs> oh, yes. I need to think this through on how it works, the system. Don't remember entirely. It's not what we have, but what we haven't. It's only thanks to Nurse Crane and the staff that our ship doesn't sink. If you have any questions, just ask her. Right. Duly noted. Thank you. Your assistance is required, Dr. Swansea, immediately. Welcome aboard, Jonathan. We'll catch up after my rounds. Come right. in, Nurse Crane. I'm coming. Aw. That guy's nice. That guy's a very nice man. Got any shillings? First and foremost, do we got any money? Right, and this is the first decision. Yeah, so here's where the decisions come in. You can either feed on people, or you can rescue them. Alright. Let's go on and talk to this guy. Oh, come on, you bastard. I won't bite. Sir, I won't. please. You've lost too much blood. Calm yourself. You think I didn't, I didn't know. Stop your staring and Don't get me to a hospital. Get me to an hospital, you ass. I'll let you bleed. Don't you fucking tempt me. <laughs> Press R2 for details. Blood quality 500. 
Medical checkup. No, no medical checkup. I'll let you bleed. You bleed out. Good luck then, sir. All right, all right. Sorry, I am in pain here. My guts are spilling out onto the street, and you're yabbering on. Yes, that's a very nasty. Movie. Now, since it is the first one, take my word. I was. I am a doctor, Doctor Jonathan Reed. <sighs> Name's Clay Cox. I'd appreciate you helping me to a better place, Doc. Follow me, Mr. Cox. Let me assist you to that better place. Blood quality indicates how much XP you will obtain from a particular citizen. The higher the blood quality, the more XP you get. To drink the blood of your prey, you first need to mesmerize them to lead them out of sight from others. Your members, your mis 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 your mesmerized level will be equal or higher than the citizen's resistance. Right. I'm just grabbing by the face. Now, this is the first decision. It doesn't really have any consequences. Dance with him, the dance of life and death. Doesn't have any rewards or consequences. That much, at least. So I'm going to feed on them. This guy's a bit of a dick, anyways. This guy's a dick. Because he's a gang leader, right? Embrace Clay will provide a massive XP boost, but be aware there will be consequences. Another one. <laughs> Another one. I remember looking it up. No nothing ever happened. Nothing ever will happen. Learn more about Citizen Collector hints. Well, increase the experience gained. Alright, on Bryce. London's a safer place. It's just a happy ending. It's just a happy ending. Oh, you bastard! Didn't have the guts to fart me. Fuck you. I'll kill you. I'll kill you. Yeah, I got luck with that. Yeah, just good luck with that. Now that's probably in a reward for saving everyone, but I'm not going to do that. I mean, it's XP. It's free XP, right? Nothing's ever going to come out of that, from what I remember. It's basically just. Right. You know, things are going to come out of that. Other than more XP, so I'm not going to argue with that, you know. So, I made the decision. I'll let you guys figure out the other ones, though. That's just kind of a showcase to show what's going to happen, how it's going to happen. So, yeah. It's Anything in there? Right. No. Might as well just go up, then. Alright, let's go. It was just free 500 XP. The only thing that really affected is probably the ending. I imagine there's like a reward for not feeding on everyone. There's probably a, some kind of reward for killing everyone. I don't know. You get the point though. You get the point. Alright, let's go. Hi. Doctor, where have you been? I've little time to play hide and seek with new staff members, no matter how illustrious they may be. Who are you to give me lip? Nurse. I needed some time to myself. This has been the longest and strangest night of my life. Yeah, you yeah, I can't blame you. Hampton from a terrible fate. The means to that end should be of little concern, Doctor. Thank you, Nurse. What can I do for you? Doctor Swansea insisted we provide you a quiet office. You'll find it on the second floor with your name on the door. Ooh. Oh, thank you. Nurse Crane. Isn't it? Yes. Yeah, Pembroke Hospital is basically our base of operations. Your office has been prepared. I have a few questions. I'd like to ask a few questions first. What kind of man is Doctor sure. Swansea? Well, you accepted the job from him. I thought you would have known about your employer. It's kind of sudden. He knows me more than I know him. Assume Dr. Swansea knows far more about me than I do about him. You'll get to know him soon enough, and better than me. The administrator has better things to do than mix with us. Right. Where's my room? You could point me in the direction of my room again, nurse. Second floor of the hospital, left after the stairs. Right. It's the last vacant office at the end of the corridor. 
Thank you, Nurse Crane. Alright. Bye. Later. There's always people to talk to about. I think I'll do that after I look at the room. Yeah. Dr. Swansea is right. This place seems perfect to conduct my research. Yeah, so this is our base of operations. Second floor? No, 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 no. I'm dumb. It's all the way down here, isn't it? It's all the way down here. If I remember correctly. Oh, shit, I really don't remember that much at all. All right. I cannot enter. There's my this office. Place. It's definitely away from prying eyes. Related I like it. to the shadows, a kingdom of my own. At least I won't be sleeping in a coffin. <laughs> this is pretty nice. This is pretty nice. Supernatural speed. Right, so I was just talking about the powers that I got. It seems. The flower's dying. It needs water. Right, there's an achievement for that, I remember. I don't know if we actually get anything other than saving the plant. Yeah, Rafael, sure. Why not? What else we got going? Nice, nice. Oh, guess officer on the next floor. Right. So we an ick on vampire. So it seems. I was going to head and upgrade. Let's go ahead and upgrade. We got some points. Yeah, probably not, huh? Ooh, that costs a lot, though. Right. I was really over the cheapest ones. There we go. Increase our stats a bit. Nice. Alright, blood capacity. That's gonna be nice, too. And then we don't have enough money for, for anything else, so. Pretty sure, at least. Oh, we got science, though. Right. Probably not, though. Probably not. Yeah, no. 300 seems to be the lowest. Cool. Let's just keep upgrading. Just keep upgrading. Once we get the chance. Don't got enough. Yeah. Nope, nope, nope. I want to confirm. Just keep upgrading the stats. Just keep upgrading the stats. Stat upgrades are always good. Hi. How's it going? The health stats did go down a little bit. Although this guy was a bit of a dick. A low life with no consideration for human beings. Save perhaps for his wife, Edwina. Right, right, right. Blah, 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 blah. Yeah, this guy's a piece of shit. <laughs> there is no relations, as you can see. He's just killable. You can steal right from him. Oh, I thought it only said 600. I was like, wow, that, that is a, that is not much for some someone who's that important. Huh. Treatment for fatigue. The guy's fatigue. Yeah. Cool. How's it going? Healthy. Alright. Alright, cool. District status healthy. Of course. Hi, how's it going? Alright, glass vial, quinine, ferrous tartrate, sodium hydrogen. I don't got any of those. <laughs> I got absolutely none. I can analyze this though. What's this? 
I regeneration serum. Oh yeah, I could use these for um buffs. Generally 300 health instantly, then only 50 health points over at 15 seconds. That's pretty nice. That's pretty nice, honestly. You can upgrade these too. Seventy-five. Lower attack speed though. Fifteen. Hacksaw. Use machete. Fifteen. Twenty stamina. So it uses more stamina, but has more damage. I don't know how I feel about that. Hmm. They don't seem to increase anything other than damage. So. You get the hacks all them higher. I do quite like axes, not gonna lie. Oh, the machete's kind of the only one we got currently. I don't think I'm going to use the machete for that much longer. Not that much longer. Right. More you upgrade. Since these upgrades only increase damage. Mmm. What would we want from this? No upgrades to really increase the magazine size, huh? Alright. R2. Got all this. All right. William Bishop's cool. blood is much more unstable than human blood and shows extensive mutation. But this is not what happened to me. I must keep on searching. Right. The sun is about to rise. I can feel it. I'll continue tomorrow night. I have so much time. We are somewhat close to the next upgrade. It should be, um... Flood capacity too. Yeah. I'm not sure how I'll do this yet. I don't know. Nope, nope, nope. I did want to go in there. Actually, do I? We got anything else we gotta collect in here first? Anything else at all? Not really. Yeah, okay. Just rest. Just rest for now. Okay. I only get in the basic upgrades for now. If I'm to stay here until my research is complete, I'd better learn to hide my true nature from the mortals. But what about my thirst for blood? Right, nice shift. Nope, nope, nope. Hmm. What do I want to use? I'll cut their bone. Nice. Ooh, it absorbs blood. That sounds pretty. That sounds pretty handy. Stamina, stamina consumption reduced. Right. I kind of like the idea of blood drain. So, I think I might go for the hacksaw, maybe. I could also wait. I could also wait, admittedly. See what else we got going on. Ah, oh, shut up. Alright. Yeah, so I got my level 2. I just want to get the basics of the basics out for now. 
Hmm. Here's that blood capacity. I want those well-rounded stats. Yeah, it's looking nice. Alright. I think I'm next. I'll go for faster regeneration. Increase your life regeneration when using Biden combat. Or big thirst. Increase your blood absorption when using Biden combat. Hmm. Like faster generation, because that's more overall. I know I'm missing on the big shiny upgrades, but big shiny cool abilities, but you know, I kind of want to get the mod normal stuff out the way, the stat upgrades. That's good. That stat upgrades are always good, right? Abilities are cool, but stat upgrades are always good. That's kind of what I'm going for right now. All right, okay, let's go. Hi. What do you want? Yes, Nurse Crane. How can I help you? I'm so sorry. I know Doctor Swansea wanted you to rest, but we have somewhat of a crisis. How's that? Crisis, you say? Our supply of antiseptics is nearly depleted. I was hoping there was another box up here, but. What type of hospital are you running? No antiseptics. I don't know how to react to that. too long, Doctor. With the war and now this epidemic, supplies have been running scarce for months now. That's probably what I shouldn't have said. I may have a solution. In France, during the war, drug shortage was a daily problem. And we had to use our wits to overcome it. Probably said nothing's in there. But then was oh, suspicious. If combined correctly, certain household chemical products can be used in a pinch instead. Now, where's the hospital storeroom? The storeroom? Fat chance. This is the Pembroke, and space is luxury we don't have. Right. Everything used to be stored in the old morgue. Ah. Uh, I should look there first. Where is this morgue? It's the large building behind the hospital. You'll need to go in the back door because it's been sealed off for sanitary reasons. Take this key. It opens a small back entrance at the end of a narrow street. The abandoned moor behind the hospital. A small door at the end of a narrow street. On my way then. Thank you, nurse. Alright, next story mission. Cool. First, though. Any supplies? Pfft. I'm not gonna look supplies a lot, but it's pretty important for upgrades and whatnot. Drug usage, etc. Um. I don't know it seems. Could be wrong. What's in here? None of those. Oh, okay. There's no way down here. I haven't really met the staff yet, have I? I do have First things first, though. First things first. Let's get going. Alright. So I'm right about here. We'll go around through here. Yeah, sounds about right. I will also need to um, ship between place to place as well. To make sure every region is healthy. Because if I don't keep it healthy, then um, more enemies will be a lot tougher in that region. So. Kind of something we gotta do. My ass through here. Give me this. Nice. Grease and screws. <laughs> it's almost useless, but it will become useful eventually. So we start getting to good stuff. Public note. Alright, that's about um the pandemic going on. Anything over here? No. All right, let's go in. Any enemies? Pretty sure there are. 
if I remember correctly. I have to give a certain part, but I don't think this is it. Ah, uh, it's probably because it's the wrong building. Alright. Go head back. It's this one. It's locked, alright. Ah. Uh, that's unfortunate. Scowl voices in the garden. I should investigate. If they were to find somebody. Alright. Hi. How's it going? Alright, come on. Cool. Oh, there was two of them, I believe. No, never mind, I'm just crazy. I'm just crazy. Alright. Oh, wait. there's a few. There's a few. Come on. Alright, come on. Drain them. Drain them. Nice. We killed them. We killed them with it. Bothery sturdy blood sample. Alright, cool. Ooh, what's in here? Shotgun shells and bullets. We don't really have a shotgun yet, but fair enough. That'd be useful eventually, though. It'll be useful eventually. Alright, let's go in here. Very first mission. That is a new tutorial. Right. So I believe it's just the basic dungeon crawl. Just go through, just kill everything. There might be a boss. I don't know. Don't remember. It has been a while. I believe it was before I actually got in the Yakuza. That's how long it's been. Right. What are we doing? How are we doing? Um. Sorry to hear that. A bit better on XP. Not over here. All right. I'm kind of sneaking so that way I can maybe get the jump on one of them. Let's find the skull. So far in the luck though. All right, glass vial. Alright. At least it's outside, so no. We don't want that. Alright, let's go through here. There's nothing in here. There's nothing. Just search. Just search and seize. Search and seize absolutely nothing is what we're gonna do. <laughs> it's locked. Door's locked. Right, we have to go up. And find the key. Find some. Balls of Mars fortifiers, <laughs> as popular as they are ineffective. But wow. they do contain iron tartrate, and that might prove itself useful. Right, right. Alright, so I'm trying to be stealthy. I'm not sure why I'm being... I'm not sure why I'm whispering, but, you know, it is how it is. Alright, there we go. We got the drop on him. 
It's a free extra damage. Alright, come on. Buy them, drain them. Never gonna finish them here. Behavior is similar to the infected William Bishop. Must be the same strain. Hmm. The sickness moves faster than influenza. Oh my. I'm not a doctor, so I have no idea what's going on. <laughs> I'm just like, yeah, yeah, okay. I believe it. They probably know what they're talking about. But why is it? Oh, hi there. All right, come on. All right, there we go. Nice, nice, nice. Okay, so we took him down. We took him down. Give me that. Give me that. Any more keys? That'd be pretty helpful. Let's get a note there. No, it's shells. Close enough. Close enough, really. Alright. Shotgun shells. I keep getting shotgun shells, but there's no shotgun. <laughs> I can't use that yet. Cannot enter. Oh. That's unfortunate. Hmm. Right. Can't enter? Locked, all right. Yeah, I know. Alright, interesting. It doesn't seem like there's um that key objective anymore. I could go on ahead and check down there. Excuse me? <laughs> Alright then. I'm getting a bit low on time here though. My finish in the next episode. Check out what's in here first. Why not? Why not? Cool. I got a blood sample. Not much else to add to that, just blood sample. Cool. Alright, let's go. Yeah, it locks behind us, doesn't it? Oh, no, it doesn't. Interesting. Alright. We'll continue or we'll continue in the next episode. Because I am somewhat ran out of time. So thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed this episode, please be sure to like, comment, subscribe, or else the channel out. Hope you're enjoying this playlist. Because it's pretty fun so far. Yeah, I'll see you in the next episode.